Guys, you probably have heard that casinos are deliberately designed to disorient visitors, hence causing them to lose track of time and place. But did you know that shopping malls employ the same same strategy? How many times have you walked into a mall or any shopping store just to check on something or even just buy a single thing but ended up with a messed up schedule altogether? Don't fret though. I swear I had no dumbest idea about this, but it really is a psychological phenomenon. It isn't our fault though. Shopping stores intentionally condition us to that. As if that is not enough, the phenomenon has a name. It's called the Gruen effect or rather the Gruen transfer. We shall talk about the name later, but let's consider some two definitions here. First, the growing effect is a moment consumers enter a shopping mall or a shopping store and, surrounded by an intentionally confusing layout, lose track of their original intentions, making them more susceptible to making impulse buys. Alternatively, it is a name given to the designs of shopping malls which are intentionally aimed at confusing a customer. Whichever definition you side with, the growing effect drives customers into a state of emotional arousal. Stores are designed to deliberately put customers' emotions and senses into overdrive. Then they become open to impulse buying. I mean, shopping is always a feast for the senses. We get attracted to color, light, smell, taste, and whatnot. And just when we think we are done being around, that is where it all begins. How is this so? Well, the Gruen effect is named after an Austrian architect, Victor Gruen. Victor spent his early life wandering around the cafes and public squares of Vienna. When he later moved to America, he wanted to recreate the social atmosphere of these public spaces. Fast forward, Gruen made a name for himself designing shops and retail spaces. He noticed that when customers get overwhelmed with sensations when they enter a store, their mindset immediately takes a twist. They tend to forget why they came in and instead consider the store, the mall, the supermarket or wherever they are as an experience to enjoy. This consequently results in them buying more items than they formerly planned simply because they were lured into the want to experience the moment. Yes, yeah, so that is it guys. So next time, just like me, when you innocently walk into a mall and you can't resist the urge to actually stay there longer than you intended to. So now you'll know why. Thanks for following me through. Kindly subscribe and share. Until next time, this is your girl Paps. And like I say in my mother language, Akuj Kidar.